More breaking news coming in. The Supreme Court has issued notices to the Uttarakhand government and the Delhi government on a petition by journalist Korban Ali seeking action against the perpetrators of hate speech against the minority community at the Dharm Sansad in Haridwar and also at a congregation in Delhi, Dharm Sansad, where these hate speeches were given. So fresh developments coming from the top court. Now notices have been issued to the state of Uttarakhand and also to the Delhi government. And this is after a petition by journalist Kurban Ali was put before the Supreme Court where it demanded action against the perpetrators of the hate speeches against minority community both at the Dharm Sansad in Haridwar and also at a congregation in Delhi. My colleague Minakshi now joins me live Minakshi, as you've been bringing to our viewers through the day, this was expected that notices might just be sent to not just Uttarakhand but also Delhi. Now it has happened. Uh, also, Greha, this formally means uh, that the Supreme Court has gone ahead and admitted this matter. This matter stands formally admitted by the Supreme Court. And uh, by virtue of this notices, uh, responses of uh, these two state governments uh, have been sought by the top court and Honorable Chief Justice of India. Uh, in no doubt, and going ahead and stating, and I quote, uh, we are going to issue notices and then let us take it up uh, after that. So, unquote, uh, that was uh, the uh, intention now with which which uh, the bench had, uh, uh, the, the bench already had that intention uh, because of which we saw the matter being listed for a hearing uh, today itself uh, only after, day before the Chief Justice of India had indicated uh, that the Supreme Court uh, will take up uh, this issue. Uh, Senior Advocate Mr. Kapil Sibul uh, was representing the interests of the petitioner Kurban Ali in this case and uh, he had to assure the Supreme Court that no likewise matter uh, is pending in any other court of the top court to a query uh, posed by the Chief Justice of India. But uh, at the end of it, uh, the matter now stands formally admitted uh, by the Supreme Court by virtue of uh, these notices that have been issued uh, to the state governments of Uttarakhand, Delhi government. And this is on a petition of uh, Kurban Ali, who's seeking action against the perpetrators of hate speech against minority community at the Dharam Sansad uh, in Haridwar. And at a congregation in Delhi. So essentially, uh, uh, Griha, what uh, these guys have prayed for before the Supreme Court is this, that uh, the state administration has been found to be adopting a lackadaisical approach, uh, dragging its feet, given the fact uh, that there is uh, uh, plenty of uh, videographic evidence that is available in the public domain, and those who are seen uh, in those uh, videos uh, against them as well, uh, no action has been taken. So that uh, is the basis of this petition in which uh, Supreme Court, after indicating day before that it will intervene, it has gone ahead and admitted uh, these petitions. Back to you. Right, Minakshi, thank you so much for giving us all those details. So this is the latest that we are getting uh, from the Supreme Court as the court has gone ahead and issued notices to the state of Uttarakhand and also Delhi.